Hello, this is Kev, and this is Black Man Being Brutally Honest, and um, if you haven't, go below the screen, hit the subscribe button, and hit the like button, and hit that notification button. Um, anyway, uh, I'm going to start off with a question uh, that has been kind of bothering me, and maybe you can answer this in the comments. Okay, here's the question. Is a male cat still a simp? Because it's a pussy. Okay, you can drop your answers in that comment section down below. But let's uh, talk about the real reason for this video. Just want to come to you for a few minutes uh, and try to explain a logic that people like Dr. Boyce Watkins keeps missing. Okay, uh, when you've seen the worst versions of a group of people who many a black parent advised their sons not to mess with, then how can you expect young black men who have done everything to get their lives in order to sacrifice most, if not all of that, for a single mother with a child? that was created by a troublesome, compromised man. How, how can you? It's, it's, it's many reasons why, you know, a lot of black men say they don't date single mothers. Uh, for one, you know, the attitudes, uh, what social media has revealed about a lot of these women, especially the one who are single mothers. Uh, we've seen the worst versions of these people and you can't ask a young black man to sacrifice anything, especially if, when there's uh, very few shots for young black men in Western culture to just put all that to side to raise someone else's kid. I mean, I don't advocate against uh, matching in energies if you're a man with a kid. You should not believe that you should get a woman with no kid. I mean, it, it could be your preference, but it's going to make a lot less sense. Uh, <laughs> you know, if she has a child and you have a child, matching energies is fine. But if you're a young man that has a bunch of stuff going for yourself, then you should not rush in to save the horrible attitude single mother generation. Now, there are some women who are feminine out there who are single mothers who would do everything in a uh, companionship requires loyalty good company and good character but those women are far and few between so I Kev would never personally go around telling young black men who have the world is their oyster to give that up for a single mother you can't ask a group of men who are constantly devalued by a lot of these same women that have to fight to add value to themselves to once again be devalued by taking on something that they didn't cause in the first place and, and let's face it a lot of these uh, sack chases be having babies by Pookie. And Pookie has been the biggest antagonist of a lot of these young black men throughout their lives. Uh, what a raw deal would it be for these young black men to have to take care of Pookie's child? Get the fuck out of here. I would never tell a young black man to do that. I mean, boys, to be so smart, you're, you're so dumb. I swear. In closing, young black men, you do not have to be a ready-made family man. Like, share, subscribe, and can we trust? Goodbye.